In this presentation, we are going to look at the concept of welfare. We are familiar with the normal supply and demand diagram, and we know that where the two curves intersect, an equilibrium price and quantity are achieved by the market. We are also aware that the area between the equilibrium price and the demand curve is known as the area of consumer surplus. The area between the equilibrium price and the supply curve is known as the area of producer surplus. Now, these two areas are intimately related to the idea of welfare because social welfare as a concept can be shown in the diagram that we have just drawn as the sum of pro consumer and producer surplus. So when we talk about the welfare that arises from the production and consumption of a good in a market, we are actually talking about the combination of consumer surplus and producer surplus. The sum of these two areas represented by this triangle here is what we understand to be social welfare. And the market is working efficiently when this total area is maximized. So when we are able to achieve the maximum social welfare, we say that the market has worked efficiently. Any situation where this area is not at a maximum is an example of market failure. 